You can say about the gameplay whatever you want. The guys and girls over at DICE are masters of creating super amazing detailed worlds for their games. These are 15 awesome details in the game Battlefield 1. If you look at the beaches on the new Turning Tides map Cape Hells, you can see the water sinking in the sand when the sea goes and returns. While on the topic of beaches, if you blow holes on the beach with explosives, they realistically fill with water. Number three is that on the British motorbike wheels, you can read non-skid tire, which is a reference to the tires used back in the day as seen on this old Firestone ad. The MCOMs on Rush are different per team. The British got plums and apples, the Americans just got a can of plums, and the Germans have meat, which are all based on real life World War I jam tin bombs. The windmills on maps like Scar are affected by weather. Same for other assets like grass. As a bonus, if you shoot your mortar in the poppy field on Rupture, the flowers move out of the way due to the air pressure. Talking about the weather, rain will actually clean up your gun from all the mud. Shell casings make different sounds depending on the surface they land on, like wood, water, or rock. Cannons actually have blowback, which not only affects the flag, but also empty vehicles like this poor guy, recorded by Smoke and Moses over on Reddit. If it rains on Amiens, water will flow down the rain pipe. Other things affected by rain are the store awnings. On snow maps, vehicles will get snowier and dirtier over time, even when not in use. If you look good enough, you can see some handprints. Talking about snow maps, the skid marks from vehicles in the snow seem to be the same as from vehicles anywhere else, like the Arty truck or the British Mark IV. Multiple maps have different small animals running around. For example, Fort Vau has bugs running out of the drain, and Nivelle Knights has rats. The belt which shot bullets on the MG14 gets longer the more you shoot. It's also affected by gravity if you look up and down. The gun also has multiple reload animations depending on how many bullets you have actually shot. If a tank is almost destroyed, you can hear the crew inside coughing due to the smoke. Back in the day, the German A7V tank could hold up to 17 crew members. And finally, in the behemoth airship, there is a brass engine telegraph, which was used during World War I to communicate with the entire crew what the driver was doing, since during World War I, the communication wasn't that advanced. The awesome thing about it is that it reacts to the actions of the airship. So if you go forward, the engine telegraph moves to forward, and if you go backward, it says back. But that is all we got time for today. Subscribe to Danny and myself, Lossie, for more, and we'll see you on the battlefield. The enemy controls all objectives. Attitude.